Good morning, everybody. I'm Eric Lufer up in the high country with Bruce Wilson, my photographer. We're heading westbound on I-70. We just passed Idaho Springs. You can see we're still seeing the remnants of snowstorms last week, and we're waiting for the new snow to start falling. It hasn't started falling yet. We noticed some fogs. We were driving through Floyd Hill, but other than that, still not dealing with any snow, but it is very cold. That cold moving east toward downtown Denver, so is the snow. You can see still icy here. Just off of I-70, Dumont is where we are this morning. And what's going to happen, Matt Makins talked about it last night, because it's going to be that light, fluffy stuff when it does start falling because it's so cold, it's going to pack down and make conditions even worse. It was a treacherous drive in the high country last week. We're going to expect that to happen again this week. And then once it moves into the metro area, we're going to deal with some rough conditions for the morning and evening commutes. May not affect the commute this morning because the snow hasn't fallen yet, but We've got to be prepared, be prepared, be prepared rather for the bitter cold as well. It's getting pretty chilly up here. I'm all prepared. No wind to deal with, so we don't have to deal with too much wind chill, but we're getting ready for another snow to hit the state. I'm Eric Lufer, 7 News Now.